12 News is your local election headquarters. Rhode Island voters face an important deadline in just a few hours. If you still need to submit a mail ballot application, you need to drop it off to election officials in person by 4 today. Time has run out to drop it in the mail. 12 News reporter Alexandra Leslie explains what else you need to know. Rhode Island election officials say this is your final reminder. If you've waited until the last minute, don't drop your mail ballot application in your mailbox. Being postmarked for today won't be enough. If you need to submit a mail ballot application before today's 4 p.m. deadline, you need to hand deliver it to your local board of canvassers found at your city or town hall. If you need the address, you can find that on the back of your application. You're also encouraged to call ahead before dropping it off. But you can also use the secure elections drop boxes, including the box outside of the Secretary of State's office in Providence. Drop boxes are in every community, but you can use any box to return your application. For voters who still need that application, it can be downloaded and printed out on vote.ri.gov, or you can also contact your local board of canvassers for help. New this year, Rhode Island voters can track the status of their application and their mail ballot on the Secretary of State's website. If you're unable to drop off an application or you put it in the mail too late, there are still ways to vote. Beginning tomorrow, Rhode Islanders can vote early in person through November 2nd. And of course, you can always vote on Election Day, November 3rd. Voters in neighboring Massachusetts still have time. Mail ballot applications are due by the 20th and early voting begins on Saturday the 17th. I'm Alexandra Leslie, 12 News.